Hello, it's been Happy Breakfast, and this time we're going in with Sabrina Carpenter's Christmas EP. I did not see this coming. It's called Fruit Cake. Now, some of these titles Cindy Lou Who, The Grinch, one of the most iconic Christmas movies of all time. Probably my favorite, to be fair, of all time. Very keen for that. Santa Doesn't Know I Like You, Buy Me Presents. I'm keen for that. A nonsense Christmas. In general, the track this thing looks very, very cool. Album cover isn't what you think it would be if the lyrical content is going to be tongue in cheek like the songs. Or maybe they're going to be legitimate Christmas songs. I have no idea. I'm going in blind, as always. I'm very keen to see what she's got for us. The Fallen Cut will be on Patreon. Links are down below. I've reacted to Sabrina's other little out. Well, actually two. One album. One album and a deluxe, I think. You can go check it out. It's on the channel. I'm in red for Christmas. i got a pink little V. Oh. Let's get festive. The first song, An Anthem's Christmas. Let's go. It's the holiday oh. Why does that sound familiar? Cool. I don't think I've ever heard an artist take their song. I'm pretty sure that's her song. I'm like, am I getting confused now? Take their song and just turn it into a Christmas song. Very cool. It's the Christmas remix. I love the puns. I love that type of cute, sexualized little Christmas vibe. Rooney from a chickadee. So cool. Next one's Buy Me Presents. Can relate. Let's go. <laughs> Essential, funny, cute. <laughs> I just love these things. It's like Gaga's Christmas tree, just like all those puns, but still feels so good, so Christmas, so cozy, and so nice. I honestly think some of these Christmas songs, like you know, and all artists, especially these, like they're just so well written. I'm like, how do people think of these things, like the puns or the innuendos? I love it. It's to me, it's like just a very clever songwriting. All right, the next song is Santa Doesn't Know You Like I Do. Let's go. Oh, slow, Chrissy. I 
didn't deserve all that. Uh -huh. Can we just like snuggle? <laughs> you wanna make those cookies you like? Oh, it's so cozy. Doesn't know you like I do. That I could be the one uh -huh. to give you everything you want. So sad. Love, love, love. Definitely gets you in the feels. You feel that longing in her heart and just wanting to be with someone. Definitely like, I was like, oh, is this super Christmassy other than the Santa? But then it definitely got there towards the end. Love it. It's such a standout track. The next song though, Cindy Lou Who. I'm so keen for this one. It's so, so, so keen. Let's go. I saw you laughing in one of his pictures. But you ring on your finger. Cindy Lou Who. <laughs> God, too short. I'm oh like, like literally two minutes. You just want so much more of that quintessential breakup heartache, but then add an old Missy Cindy Lou Who. What does she ever do? It's not Cindy Lou's fault. I love that. That's sick. So good. Just perfectly done. The next song isn't New Year's yet. Let's go. Oh. Love, said it all before, quintessential, just so nice, so encapsulating of the Christmas vibe, but not because it's about not liking it. I love it. We're the last song, number six is here, pair of number eight is the best song, little EP, it's called White Xmas. Let's wrap it up, let's go. Oh, she's giving us a cover. Oh, uh, I... Jingle bells to jingle 
wrap it up. I really, really like that EP. It definitely encapsulates the tongue-in-cheek, the puns, the metaphors, but still has that quintessential Christmas vibe and then wrapping it up with that. Chuck and Jingle Bells on the end, just to get one more in. Six songs, cute little EP, very, very nice. So unexpected, and like I said, I don't think I've heard an artist do a song of theirs but change it into a Christmas song, so that was very cool. Cindy Lou Who, Love, Santa Doesn't Love You, Heartbreaking, Bummy Presents, Nonsense Script, they're all, all just sick, sick flow through. Not a filler, not a skip, all just so nice. What was your favorite? Let me know down below. Are we keen for Christmas? Are you a Christmas lover or a Christmas hater? I'm absolutely a Christmas lover. I can't wait for December. Can't wait to put up the Christmas trees and just get all cozy and nice and ready for, yeah, Christmas. I love it so much. Well, the cast is always on Patreon. Links are down below. Go check out one of the videos. They're all on my channel. You know what to do right now. Other than that, I'm going to